In a significant push towards enhancing India's indigenous defence capabilities and fostering a robust domestic aerospace industrial ecosystem, Defence Minister Rajnath Singh has approved the Advanced Medium Combat Aircraft Programme Execution Model. Aeronautical Development Agency is all set to execute the programme through industry partnership. Well, this is an important step towards harnessing the indigenous expertise, capability and capacity to develop the AMCA prototype, which will be a major milestone towards Atma Nirbharta or self-reliance in the aerospace sector of India. And this also comes as a major push to India's defence capabilities. It is a fifth generational aircraft that India will be getting earlier. The process was uh, fa uh, was made uh, to a fast track mode and now finally the approval has been moved uh, by Defence Minister Rajnath Singh as he has approved the model which comes as a major, major push to India's defence capabilities. It is a robust domestic aerospace industrial ecosystem and also a very important step towards harnessing uh, the defence sector of India and especially when we talk about India's vision of becoming fully Atmanirbhar or self reliant there are other major milestones which the defense sector has already achieved and this also comes as another milestone to india's hat and now to discuss more on this i'm joined by dd india correspondent ravi deman who joins us on the phone line good morning ravi tell us about the significance of this program model and how does that strengthen india's vision of becoming self-reliant or atmanirbhar well this is an important step uh, towards making the fifth a generation stealth fighter plane that India desperately needs now, uh, given the current security scenario uh, in the immediate neighborhood. And, uh, uh, you know, the battle for air supremacy is changing uh, uh, with every day, with every battle. Uh, the air superiority challenges are mounting, and more and more countries are now devoting their time and energy and resources on developing the fifth generation, that is stealth fighter planes, uh, which are invisible to the normal radar. Uh, their signatures are not caught on the normal radar. India has also initiated uh, an ambitious program of AMCA, that is the Advanced Medium Combat Aircraft. This is a fifth generation uh, fighter aircraft that will be developed uh, uh, in India uh, uh, totally indigenously. and. Uh, to give it a further fillet to the program, this uh, approval of the program execution model has been given by the Raksha Mantri. And that uh, necessarily means that India will now devote all resources at, at its disposal to, uh, you know, uh, uh, and develop uh, AMCA. Uh, the execution model now will provide uh, opportunities to both uh, the public sector companies uh, which have experience in aeronautical engineering as well as private sector firms who can uh, contribute towards uh, the development of uh, this crucial fighter plane for the Indian Air Force and the armed forces. So uh, uh, basically the government has opened the doors for the private sector as well uh, to come and compete uh, uh, towards making uh, of this uh, very crucial aircraft for the Indian Air Force. And they can, uh, you know, bid uh, either independently or they can bid together with the uh, public sector company or as a consortia. So uh, uh, this is an important step uh, in involving the private sector, harnessing the technical and uh, the, uh, you know, technological talent that India has uh, to its uh, potential. And, uh, you know, uh, basically tapping the potential to ensure that uh, India remains uh, uh, ahead of the adversaries as well as air security is concerned. This project is a very crucial to maintain India's air security in the immediate neighborhood. And also when we talk about uh, the collaboration with the industrial sector, how is it going to help economically because India has already become the fourth largest economy so far? Uh, uh, you see, uh, Dikita, if we uh, turn around and look back 10 years uh, uh, under Prime Minister Narendra Modi, the defense sector has uh, flourished in India. The domestic defense sector was given a fillet, it was prioritized uh, in the scheme of things. And we have seen defense industrial corridors in coming up uh, and flourishing in two states, in Tamil Nadu and uh, Uttar Pradesh. And uh, the focus has been consistently on homegrown te uh, technology, on homegrown uh, products, defense products, which not only save the crucial uh, uh, foreign uh, exchange, but also give, uh, you know, uh, rise to competitive industries, uh, domestic industries, they give rise to employment 
and and then not only direct employment uh, through the factories but indirect employment uh, through the supply chains uh, which have a domino effect on the entire local and macro economy so that that way uh, uh, this uh, you know uh, uh, approval of the program execution model will provide further fillet to indian startups indian aeronautical companies hmm. uh, budding companies private firms and startups who have uh, the technological edge and potential to contribute to amca and it will go a long way in you know propelling the indian aeronautical industry uh, further